Greetings Clovis Elementary families. This is your principal Donnell Kellum with a wrap up from our first quarter of school. The first quarter ends on Friday, October 15th and it's been a fantastic first nine weeks of our school year. Thank you so much for sharing your students with us. Our teachers and entire staff is so grateful for the progress they've already made and are just really enjoying having them on campus. You should have received an income verification form. These were sent home with students on Thursday, and I wanted to take a quick moment to explain why you are being asked to participate in this process. I will also point out that this form asks for a student ID. You do not need to fill out this section. These details are important as we move forward in collecting data to support our students in Clovis Unified School District. So regardless of your eligibility, please fill out this form for all of your students and send it back to school by October 25th. We want to make sure that all of the resources available to our students are being allocated. The local control funding formula bases the allocations to each district and school on several different several different demographic points, one of those being parent income. If we have a certain percentage of students and families qualifying for free and reduced lunch, the district would be eligible to receive additional funds. We appreciate your help and support in getting these filled out and returned to school by October 25th. We also provided you with an envelope to send them back to school in. We want to assure you that no one is going to be viewing these important personal family details. They will be sent in by our district office. At Clovis Elementary, for the classes who have the most forms turned in, they will earn a snow cone party on November 5th. Clovis Unified School District is also offering several incentives for those of you who are able to get that form turned in. There's going to be a drawing for gift cards and AirPods, lots of great things in store. Parent-teacher conferences are coming up. On Friday, October 29th, there is no school for students to allow all of our parents the opportunity to chat with their child's teacher. You're going to be able to sign up for an appointment on Blooms. These meetings can be held either in person or on Zoom. You're going to get great updates and details on your child's progress. I want to remind grades K through 2 will earn, will get some feedback on a standards-based report card. Students in grades 3 through 6 earn letter grades. Those letter grades are available in Parent Connect. If you have not already signed up for Blooms, there are some instructions here. We will have all of the Blooms codes available on our website. Also, they have been attached to the email message you received when you got the link to this video. We greatly appreciate you taking the time to connect with the teacher on Blooms. It provides a great way to communicate. In addition, sign up for things like parent-teacher conferences. Our Apex Fun Run was a huge success. We cannot thank you enough for your participation, your generosity, and the tremendous support. We were able to surpass our goal, and the kids had a phenomenal time. Trunk or Treat is also coming up. That's going to be on Thursday, October 28th, right here at Clovis Elementary. The cost for that is $2 per participant at the door or at the entrance. We are not doing pre-sale this year. It's gonna start at six o'clock with voting. We're gonna have some great food trucks available. We look forward to a wonderful community event that is possible from your donations. Each classroom is collecting bags of candy and we are keeping a tally so that the class who has the most returned will earn a pizza party. And that's courtesy of our parent teacher club. We're so grateful for the wonderful opportunities for our community. Again, it's been a great first quarter. We appreciate everyone's support and look forward to seeing you soon.